Hey y'all, it's Deanna with Dee's Garden Adventures. I think I forgot to say that in the last couple of videos. I said my name, but anyway. Um, hope everybody's doing all right. Hope nobody had really bad storms last night. Uh, today is what is today? Thursday, the sixteenth, I believe, of February. Um. But there's supposed to be more bad storms today, so hopefully nobody gets a nasty, nasty storm. This crazy weather, it doesn't know what it wants to do. Anyway, I had mentioned I'd do a uh, Baker Creek haul when my other one package of seeds came in, but I still don't have it. And it's just a package of uh, cabbage that's supposed to be more heat tolerant. So maybe I can get some cabbage... <coughs> into the early part of summer before it gets extremely hot but <coughs> anyway excuse my coughing um, I cough all the time so I have a Baker Creek haul and some of these are already open I've planted some and I'll go over a video of everything that I have planted at some point I'll do a video I might do it later today excuse me the wind's blowing real bad outside though and the, you know I have a greenhouse but the polycarbonate it's awful loud when the wind blows because that stuff flexes <coughs> and makes noise anyway I got some um paprika peppers I don't even know how to say that other word <coughs> but it's to, you can make your own Hungarian paprika And then I got some stevia. I'm going to try to grow it. We will see. I don't know which way is... Uh, the best way to turn this stuff. So, I'm not real <clears throat> up on how your f landscape on your phone is supposed to be turned to be best for YouTube. Then I got some Sunrise Bumblebee uh, tomatoes. They're cherry tomatoes. They're supposed to be really good. They're supposed to be sweet and fruity. <clears throat> and then I got Sun Gold Select. And these are supposed to be really good too. And make a lot of little yellow tomatoes. <coughs> or orange. And it's supposed to be one of the tastiest orange tomatoes out there. We will see. I got some Thai Holy Basil. I don't use a whole lot of basil when I cook, but I'm trying to make a uh, Thai, not Thai, basil tea to drink. Or put the basil in my tea and let it steep. Now this I couldn't put, I wouldn't put in my tea, but I'd make basil tea, but not regular tea with basil in it. Lime basil. And then I thought this might be good if I got the urge to make um, some kind of cookie. Or uh, ice cream or something. Then I got little gem lettuce. They're just little old things. They're little um, romaine type lettuces. This was my freebie. I think I got this free on, on a different year too. The Japanese wasabi radish. I got some Kajari melon. It's um collected by Joseph Simcox in India. Copper red fruit striped with green and cream. Very sweet pale flesh. I got this um, after watching, uh, I've seen it on Roots and Refri Refuge and she talks about how good it is. And then a New England sugar pie. Little squash or pumpkin. It weighs, they weigh four to five pounds. <coughs> Excuse me, good for pies. Not that I make pumpkin pie much, but animals like to eat melon, pumpkin. Then a sweet dumpling squash. And it's got sweet tender orange flesh. One pound fruit, white striped with green. Now, all these squash are, you know, dependent on that stupid vine borer. I 
hate that thing. Honey Boat Delicata Squash. Which is an uh, oblong delicata shape tan with green stripes developed in Oregon at Oregon State University. It's supposed to be really sweet. And then a Texas Early Grano onion. It's a sweet. Ew, it's a short day. Heh, <laughs> crud. Mine's long. My onions are supposed to be long day. Oh, well, I planted them. We'll see what happens. <laughs> Too late now. I planted them. That's, that's all right. Well, that's it for um the Baker Creek. I do have a couple of other little things. <coughs> there's a... There's a... Um, Facebook page called Tomato Obsession where you can do sweet seed swaps and win seeds sometimes and sometimes people will donate to your wish list and I have a couple of things. I don't have pictures but um, I got copia tomatoes and Polish pastel and um, these are supposed to be more on the less acidic side. I do remember that because I'm not real big on acidic tomatoes. I prefer the ones that have a little more sweetness. But I traded for those. I don't remember what I traded with her. I gave her two different seeds. Um, you have to give them five of each seed that you trade. But um, anyway. And then the other one I did. And she was nice. She sent a picture. Is Nature's Riddle. It's a big beef steak. Orange and yellow veined with pink becoming red when ripe. Sweet with exotic fruit aromas. It's an indeterminate, so. I think those other two are indeterminate also. But yeah, um, that's a pretty neat little thing. I saw, um, I didn't even know those Facebook pages existed. There's Pepper Obsession too, which I haven't traded on yet, but. I watch Jen Joy. She's on Facebook. No, not Facebook. I'm sorry, YouTube. And uh, her biggest thing is tomatoes. She's got, I don't know how many hundreds of varieties of tomatoes. But uh, she talked about this Facebook page where you could swap seeds. And so I joined it. All right, y'all. That's it for now. Um, I think that's, well... That's all the big orders I'm going to have because I had a lot of seeds left from left from last year. And I did get some more at Dollar General this year, like some squash and some beans and cucumber. And, um, but I forgot to get um, rosemary. So I've got to order. I've either got to order a package of rosemary or find the seeds in the store. Because I love rosemary and I can't believe I forgot to get it. I thought I had some, but I don't. Anyway, y'all, um, y'all have a good one. Take care. Be careful in this crazy weather we have. Um, talk to you later. Bye.